Yo, what's going on guys? Hope you guys are doing well. Uh, it is Sam here and I'm gonna do a, this same style of video that I did for the last style of video where I, I really just kind of talk about issues that I think uh, are in the community and things that are relevant as well. And forgive me, I am a little bit sick right now and I, I am playing duels live. But I, yeah, I, I got a comment um, from a guy and he said, you know, he really liked these styles of videos. I'm still trying to find my flow when it comes to Minecraft about the kind of stuff that I like to record and stuff that's fun for me to do. So first off, I'd like to apologize and say, I, you guys, as you guys can probably hear, I am pretty sick right now. Um, it's just that week of the year where your allergies or your sinuses just hit you really, really hard, which happens to me every year. Um, so that's why I sound very nasally. It's because I'm very congested, and even if I've taken like the right medicine and stuff, like I'm, I'm just really congested, and I, I, I'm not feeling my best. Anyway, guys. Anyway, uh, I wanted to talk to you guys today about something that you know I, I'm briefly touched on in the past, and that is why I kind of dislike the Minecraft YouTube community nowadays. Um, and I, I don't get this the wrong way. Um, I don't dislike specific people. I, I, what I, my qualms are with how things are done. So pretty much everywhere you look nowadays, it's all, everybody just has to do, the, I, I mean, and don't get me wrong, I guess a part of YouTube and the social media scene is trying to clickbait stuff and, you know, making sure you're getting the right clickbait and like very baby thumbs. There was the whole abusing YT rank fiasco videos to get, you know, 600K views, ridiculous views off of just really, really cheeky content and again don't get me wrong i'm not putting down anybody who did like abusing yt rank or you know like any anybody's content in particular like i like i said i don't really care and if you do if you do this stuff um as as a creator i don't dislike you um but i i think i'm trying to figure out where the real issue lies like should i be upset at the community for wanting to watch that should i be upset at youtube's algorithm for making that what people have to do to get viewership because i feel like there's a ton of great creators out there that aren't getting recognition that are you know focusing on you know a lot of gameplay stuff that aren't doing super clickbait like to be honest like kind of fake content you know like fake content and, I, and again like you know if you have a community where you know you have a lot of adults older people playing a game that's you know meant for a lot of younger people um and when i say younger people you know i know a lot of you guys who watch me are you know in the mid teenage years which is great but you know when i but there's still like a very large you know child's community in minecraft like they're like obviously it's a, it's a it's a game meant for younger people that you know a lot of older people still enjoy to play but I feel like some of the content that I, I like, there's some of the stuff I look at it and I say, dude, I cannot bring myself to do that. Like, I am never going to be a fake creator. I do not want to be somebody that's fake. I want my, my videos to be me, you know? And again, like, I'm not, I really want to emphasize that I'm not trying to put anybody in particular down because like I said, this is just a very general video talking about a general topic, but I'm curious to know what you guys think about kind of like this community and like all the high pixel videos I see like, all like it caps titles like oh my god buddy please don't do that it's like banned on you know you're like you know i don't know abusing my t-rank or like the new like xx release like it's just like dude like oh my god like i don't know i, I wouldn't feel happy doing that kind of stuff anyway it's just like so i, I don't know i guess just so upset i like it honestly upsets me that like this that's what the community has come to you know and i'm sure a lot of you guys can relate like if you guys think back to, you know, a year or two ago, and again, like, things change and things move on, and, you know, that's kind of just how it is, but, you know, it, it's really upsetting to me, because, like, there used to be all these, like, you know, SG YouTubers, and, you know, Bad Lion, there was, like, ELO series and stuff, and then, don't get me wrong, there still are a lot of those series out there, but, you know, it's, like, there's just so much, like, spam about, like, you know, Hypixel and Minecraft, and... There are some unique videos out there, like there was, I, I know Nestor had a video that popped off, it was called like, the $8,000 Minecraft account, and you know, that was pretty unique, and I saw one of Technoblade's videos, got like 2 million views, where he beat Minecraft hardcore mode with a steering wheel, which I thought was pretty funny. Like, there's a lot of great unique stuff out there like that, that I actually like, and I think that's pretty cool, but then there's like, you know, all these people just like totally stretching the lines of clickbait to just like just clearly like reaching for views not based off the content and just like creating drama to get views and i i honestly feel like everywhere i turn i see that in the minecraft pc community nowadays and i don't oh my and rest in peace my man oh no he oh no he's gonna call me for hacks he is right now he so is he so is bro the rod spam is real <laughs> He didn't call me for hacks. I respect it. I respect it. This guy has a two character name. 
Oh, I just got baited. It was a three character name. Oh my god, I thought that was gonna be so cool. What? I don't know, man. I just literally don't see myself doing it, and I see I see that kind of content everywhere, and I honestly want to know what you guys think about it. Do you think the Minecraft community has gotten better in terms of content creation, or has it gotten worse? I think it's gotten worse in terms of misleading viewers in the community. Um, like, back in the day, you know, I mean, even, you know, nowadays, you have to have guys like X-Turtle kind of just came on and, like, hacked and made it, made it seem like it was okay to cheat, and, like, cheating should be accepted in the community. Um, I think cheating in Minecraft and account account stealing is probably like the two biggest problems in multiplayer Minecraft. Uh, other than that, like we talk about PvP, but like not not in terms of game mechanics. Uh, I, I don't know, like I, that stuff's not okay. So like I just feel like the quality of YouTube videos has shifted from you know focusing on Minecraft gameplay to just as much clickbait as possible to make people want to watch the videos, even though it's not even it might not even be relatively relatively accurate. Like I feel like everybody's rushing a pack release or a you know, a mods release, or a, uh, you know, I, I got false banned, or, yeah, or a, uh, I don't know, like, what else, what else is there? Or, you know, the giveaways, but that's a different thing. Giveaways is kind of, like, a whole different thing, but, like, or, like, you know, abusing my T rank, right? Like, there's just so much crap out there, man, and I honestly do not know what to think of it. Like, I, it's, it's, I'm, I'm gonna tell you straight up, it's very discouraging to guys like me, uh, creators like me, who want to create good gameplay content about Minecraft, but then again, you know, that kind of content might might not have as much merit because it's so oversaturated now you know and to be honest there used to be a lot of competition on minecraft where you had a lot of a, a big variety of games but nowadays it's really only hypixel like if you think about it like hypixel is the most dominant server on minecraft and you know what back in the day you know you had so you had like a lot of different groups of creators, right? You had, you know, like Stimpy that who played Kohi and Mine HQ, and then if it wasn't that, you know, you had Alex playing Kohi, and there were so many places to play. And you know, then there was like the UHC community that played Bad Lion, and everything's kind of coming to one. And there's just so many creators that I don't think people really know what to do to get views, right? And you know, there was also Mindplex, there was like the Mindplex group, and then there was like Hypixel YouTubers as well, and QCraft and Hive. There used to be so many networks out there for so many creators to have different kinds of content. And I feel like that really helped variety. But I think the big thing, that might be the big thing I'm seeing is that everything is so oversaturated with like Hypixel being the only thing that gets a lot of views nowadays. Um, and believe me, like Hypixel is pretty much the only server that you can get a ton of views on because I mean, again, it has the most players and the largest player base. Uh, but when player bases were split, there was a lot of interaction between other networks, not just Hypixel. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm solving the case right now, chat. But yeah, after player bases split, maybe that kind of forced all the creators into one big group and meta, especially now that, you know, Bad Lion is kind of like slowed down quite a bit. Most I can, I can make a video on that if you guys want about why I think Bad Lion kind of slowed down. Um, I did one for Mindplex and you guys actually kind of liked it, uh, but I can talk about, I mean, I, you know, I'm, Private Fearless kind of touched on everything. If you haven't seen his video, um, it, I, it's okay, never mind. But yeah, back to my point. I, th I, I There was so much content out there. There's so many places to record, so many games that people like to play. Now it's really only Skywars and Bedwars and, you know, Murder Mystery occasionally. But like, in terms of like, big networks having a lot of places for creators to get healthy, good comp content out there in terms of gameplay, they're just not so much there anymore. And it really could be because Minecraft hasn't really had any good updates for like PvP and stuff and people are just kind of over it, you know, that could be, could be the case. But in all honesty, like, let me know what you guys think as well, because it's definitely, definitely had a, we've definitely seen a, a, a large drop in the quality of videos, in my opinion, and it's very discouraging for guys who like to focus, like, I pride myself on being a gameplay YouTuber, right? You know, I can still act and, you know, have fun in my videos and do comedy videos, but I think the main reason people want to come to my channel and why, what I would like it to be, okay, it's this guy who, who accusated me earlier, um, is because I want to show them good gameplay with a good commentary, somebody who just enjoys playing games and is pretty good at playing games. That's kind of what my whole spiel is, and that's why I want you guys to sub. Not you again. Oh my god. If y'all see this guy, be sure to tell him I said hello, and be sure to link him the video as well. Tell him one day he'll be a great PvPer. <laughs> okay. Should I kill him with an axe? I'm gonna kill him with an axe. Yeah, ready, ready, ready? Ready? Watch this. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna get my axe out. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Here we go. Okay. BM, BM time. <laughs> BM time, BM time. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Anyway, I think that's as much as I can talk before my voice gives out. So thank you all for watching. P please be sure to leave some feedback down in the comments uh, below. Um, I I'm going to be listening and, and paying attention to what you guys have to say. 
Uh, I'm, I don't know, man. I don't know. Let's, let me see your thoughts. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you all later. Peace out.